Here in the Kenyan capital, Nairobi, the newspapers are awash with headlines about the college massacre. People living here are calling for tolerance and unity, but there's also a feeling the government could have done more to prevent the bloodshed, and there's a call for a tightening up of security operations. It's very sad, this man says. I really don't understand why Al-Shabaab are targeting us. We're their neighbours. We should be helping each other, but instead they are destroying our environment, not giving us peace and taking our country backwards. The security agencies. It's reached a point where the security agencies give out information, but the police themselves are unable to protect us, as they're supposed to be doing, this man says. It means someone is sleeping while they're on duty. There were warnings last week that an attack on a university was imminent, a fact that makes it all the harder for the scores of mourners now left praying for the dead. We have